What is up, everybody? I am Get Flanked, and it looks like we have a limited time event coming to Rainbow Six Siege. On screen right now, you're seeing the trailer for it, and this definitely caught me by surprise. It looks like it's going to run from November the 20th through the 25th. It's uh, coupled with a free period for the game, so everybody will be able to play the game for free during that time period. I'm guessing this is going to be a discovery playlist within the game during that time, and it looks like it's centered around the game mode of Hostage, uh, and it's also a partnership with Netflix, and they're promoting the show Money Heist through Rainbow Six Siege. So to me, it looks like you're going to be able to play hostage and you're going to have a couple of different cosmetic bundles associated with this event. The uniforms and the masks that you're seeing in this trailer are uh, associated with the TV show um, that is being promoted, Money Heist. Uh, by the way, it, it's actually a pretty good show. Uh, I've watched uh, some of it, not all of it. There's three seasons on Netflix. It goes by a couple of different names. It was originally recorded in Spanish. So um, on Netflix, I always saw it as La Casa de Papel. Uh, which is translated the house of paper, but uh, in America, it's known as money heist, I guess you could say. Um, so I think if you search for either of those on Netflix, you'll find it, but it's actually a good show. Like I highly recommend it. It reminds me a lot of like Ocean's 11. If you like the Ocean's 11 movies where they like plan the heist and then execute the heist, then I think you'll like the show as well. So based upon the trailer, it looks like the cosmetic bundles are going to be for Habana and Vigil, and they look pretty cool. Like As somebody who has seen some of this show, I'm actually kind of excited for these cosmetic bundles. Uh, they look pretty cool in the game. I'm also excited to try out the game mode. I don't think, based upon what we're seeing in this trailer, that it's going to be any different kind of rules with Hostage. To me, it just looks like it's going to be a Hostage game mode on bank with some different like where the hostage looks a little bit different um so i don't expect it to be like a you know like a big event like we get like you know once per season with these like you know rainbow is magic events or anything like that but still pretty cool nonetheless so that's about all I know as far as the event. Let me talk just a little bit really quick here about how our little Rainbow Six Siege game is growing up. Like, this is cool to see Netflix, uh, I guess, sponsoring Rainbow Six Siege. I'm guessing that Netflix is paying Rainbow Six Siege to promote this show within the game, uh, unless there's some type of back-end relationship that I'm not familiar with, which there very well may be. But to me, it would appear that Netflix is paying Rainbow Six Siege to promote one of their shows. And that's really cool. I mean, to think about how far Rainbow Six Siege has come, you know, if you're somebody who's been following this game for a long time, there's no doubt it's gotten more popular over time. When you think about how this game launched and, you know, um, it, it wasn't great upon launch to think about how far this game has come since launch and the fact that it's now, you know, in a position where it, it's being sought out by companies to help them promote their products is really cool. I think that says a lot about this game and it says a lot about the dev team for sticking with it and making it as great as it is. Um, you know, we've seen stuff like this in Fortnite before with like Star Wars and some of the Marvel uh, movies, you know, working with Fortnite to do like a cross promotion. And it's cool to see this enter Rainbow Six Siege, you know, a game that we all love. And uh, I don't know, it's just kind of like a special moment for me. Like I know to some people out there that they're not going to bat an eye at this, like this doesn't matter to them. But as somebody who's been playing Siege since the beta, it's kind of crazy to me to see, um, you know, that how far this game has come. So anyway, guys, if you actually look up this show on Netflix, it's got a pretty high Rotten Tomatoes score. Uh, again, I haven't watched the whole series, uh, but I have watched enough of it to recommend it if you enjoy heist-type uh, shows. Um, but that's really all I wanted to say. New event. Get in. Check it out. Uh, also, you know, free weekend. Uh, so if you have any friends who you want to get involved with Rainbow, make sure you let them know that they can try it for free. I guess not a, a weekend, but, you know, a five-day period where they'll be able to play the game for free. So let them know about that. Uh, guys, if you enjoyed this video, please make sure that you like and subscribe, and I'll have more coming your way here soon.